Good morning guys and um, welcome back to the Sullivan family. So it is Tuesday, Tuesday morning. Uh, right, so we have a bit of news today. There's a bit of exciting news. So we didn't say anything in the last vlog or the previous vlog, but we have been invited by Murray Firth Radio, MFR, as known in the north. Oh, oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Zoe, could you hold that up for me, Zoe? Oh. Trousers have come through. Oh, Maybe trousers have come Okay. <laughs> Say morning. <laughs> Say morning, everybody. Say thanks for subscribing. <laughs> Is that too much? A bit too much. Yeah, so we have been invited by Murray Firth Radio, who um, heard about our charity fundraiser for Cash for Kids. It's basically, it's an MFR um thing they they um they advertise it she's gone down again no no she, she she's off doing stuff say hi zoe hi she's, trying to put my washing. she's just doing the washing at the moment baby's got down no 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 these are dirty yes so i digress so murray firth radio run the uh, cash for kids and the cash for kids mission christmas and obviously the charity page that we have is run through them and it's a, a separate thing and any any money that's raised goes straight onto their charity page onto our charity page run by mfr radio so anyway they heard about the story that we're doing with doing the challenge every month uh and you guys doing some, an amazing thing supporting us as well i mean we've raised 627 pounds so far and it's only just coming into february and that is absolutely amazing amazing because but on that by that reckoning we should smash our thousand pound target which would be absolutely fantastic It'd be really really good so they heard about what we're doing and they invited us in for a chat. Well, I didn't want to say anything just in case um, anything changed and we couldn't go in and all that kind of stuff. So the plan is I'm going to take the kids to school in about 20 minutes. I've got to drop my car off to the garage to get the brakes looked at. And then Zoe's going to come and pick me up and then we're going to head off to Inverness. Very exciting. Never been to MFR before. We listen to them on the radio all the time um, and we can't wait really. Uh, to go over there and just experience where M4 is and meet some of the some of the radio presenters and, and all that kind of stuff. So we're really, really looking forward to it. So exciting day for us. Anyway, that'll be the morning. Whatever we do in the afternoon, I'm not sure yet. Obviously there'll be the school run to do. We're only going we're only literally going for the morning. So uh, the appointment we've got is at half past ten. So yeah, so I've got my YouTube dad t-shirt on. And um, we're going to big up our subscribers because you guys are amazing and you've been really supportive. So, um, yeah, I can't wait. Are you looking forward to it, Zoe? <laughs> so he said, I haven't put any makeup on yet. Why don't start the video? I haven't put any makeup on yet. Anyway, I'm, we're going to crack on because I've got to get the kids ready to go to school. So we'll probably now see you over in... Well, I don't know. We'll see you, we'll see you when we see you. Sunshine and sleep when it's dark. Hoping to find somewhere we can calm But it's black, yeah it's black Oh the water's black Cause it's black, it's all black Black water If I had some time I'd be biting it well But my house is on fire, there's no one left to tell
Okay guys, the car is in. The car is in for its brakes to be looked at. They've been a bit grumbly over the last couple of days, so I wanted to get them checked. It's better to be safe than sorry. So um, Murray Motors are gonna have a look at it for me today, but I'm just waiting now for Zoe to pick me up so we can head over to Inverness. It's really cold this morning, really cold, really frosty, but lovely though, lovely in the sunshine. So anyway, guys, next next time you see us, we shall probably be in Inverness. So I'll catch you uh, over there. Okay guys, we've arrived. We are a little bit late, so we're gonna go straight into the radio station and we will report to you afterwards. Okay guys, we are back from Inverness. We are back after a fantastic morning. It was really cool. It was really good fun. It was really, really good fun. So we were in there for about, what, an hour? Oh, excuse me. In about an hour with Jodie, who does the uh, breakfast show on, on Murray Firth Radio on MFR and um, we had a blether about everything didn't we? Everything. <laughs> Kids, family, everything. YouTube channel, why we set up a YouTube channel, how long we've been going, <clears throat> our family, being on TV, um, all, the, all that sort of stuff. Then we had a good old natter about the uh, charity page didn't we? Yeah that was mainly what it was for mm. wasn't it? It was to kind of go over and um, chat about uh what we are doing for mfr cash for kids. kids mission christmas i've got something in my eye it's really annoying <laughs> it's really annoying i can't concentrate on what i'm talking about because it's I not have a something in my eye so yeah that was kind of the main reason we were invited over was to talk about um what we're doing to you know help raise money for mission christmas basically yeah but it kind of um you just started it and put the world to work. So <laughs> yeah, we did. It's really, we it, did. It's it was really lovely. nice putting a face to a name because obviously I drive to school every morning. I listen to her on the radio every morning. So it's a little bit like a little bit surreal because, you know, you hear a voice on the radio. You don't, you don't, you know, you haven't met them before. So it's really nice being able to put a face to a name. It's not slightly starstruck because <laughs> obviously we listen to her every morning. Um, but yeah, it was really, it was really nice. It was nice talking about the family, you know, just talking about the like ben said like i uh, talking about the youtube channel um and why we're helping to raise money for um cash for kids cash for kids really um or why we're using our platform if you like to help raise money um for the mission christmas especially i mean we always um in the past we've always put you know gifts in for anybody that doesn't come from here who doesn't i'm sure they do things in other places in the country and parts of the world but basically um mfr every year um they they do lots of things throughout the year but one of their they do lots of things for cash for kids but one of the things that they do is mission christmas yep. um which is where they raise money and people can either donate gifts or or money um they've got drop-off points all around yeah to to for children in the north yeah. of scotland to make sure that everybody gets every child gets a a, a present at christmas uh, on christmas day so in the past we've donated gifts haven't yeah we? like mm -hmm. this this year just gone um each one of the kids donated a gift um so we like put sort of 12 14 gifts in um but you know in previous years we've given we've given gifts or we've given money or whatever yeah, but it just having a, a bigger platform felt like we could do more yeah you know because it's okay definitely. you know it's, if that's all you can do then donating a gift donating a small amount of money is brilliant but with having the platform that we've got we just thought you know wouldn't it be good if we could do more than just giving a gift or just giving um money like we normally would yep. um if we could <clears throat> if we could add more to it <clears throat> which is why we decided to well involve you guys as well yeah i mean cause it's been great Driving, driving to work all the way through Christmas and listening to it on the radio and there's been kids raising money, kids raising hundreds of pounds and then companies getting involved and it's just fantastic. So so we thought, well, why not? We'll give yeah. it a shot. Give it a shot. Give it a go. 
um, and obviously MFR wanted to um, to chat to us about it as well. And they, they were they were great as well. They made us a coffee and all that kind of stuff. So they made us feel really really welcome. So it's fantastic. It's lovely to actually yeah, go and see really nice. go really... and see where it all happens when you listen to the radio every single day. They're a really nice know. team. A really nice team of mm -hmm. people. Um, and like you said, they made us feel really welcome. The kids. Obviously, we had some of them with us, and the little ones. Um, they all got to kind of sit and chill out while yeah. we were doing the interview and then we got goodies as well yeah we, we now did. have lots of these which where's the t-shirts <laughs> which are probably going to be used to um for games later i can't hold it up because so i'm holding myself so we've got some t-shirts to wear as well we've got about 30 microphones we've got lots of these oh they're cool which the kids are going to love because they're inflatable so they're going to love those um but yeah it's just it's just really nice um going along and just having a chat about what just experiencing it really and, and having a chat with jody from from the morning show and um and the rest of the team at mfi is really really cool isn't it just see a pineapple it's really <laughs> <a pretty>. <laughs> <laughs> yeah yeah it was um it was really good it was a bit of a whirlwind so we did we couldn't film much to, to be honest because it was a bit of a whirlwind we got over there by the skin of our teeth because we got lost twice didn't we sorry we got lost twice. Zoe, Zoe, I am rubbish. Zoe was my map man. I'm rubbish at directions. Don't ask me to give anybody <laughs> directions because we very rarely travel in a car together anymore because there's normally two cars, but we only took one car today. And you normally um, follow me. And I normally follow Ben. And Ben somehow just knows where he's going, but I don't. I'm rubbish at directions. And I had the map, the Google map, and it's really not that hard to find, but Inverness is a little bit... It's There's stuff everywhere. It's just. It's like a rabbit warren. Yeah, it, it is like a rabbit. There's roads everywhere. Um, and I thought we were taking the right road, but we weren't. We were taking the wrong road. But as we, as it happened, if we'd carried on that road, we would have got to the place anyway. So, but well, we did get there by the skin of our teeth on time. Just on time. Um, but obviously, we had to drop the little ones off at school first. You had to put your car in the garage. So, yep. yeah, it was a bit I haven't of a heard back yet about the car. I'm a waiting, of, waiting to see <clears> that. We, all, we just made it on time because obviously, coming from Berkhead to Inverness is a lot quicker than going from Lossie to Inverness. Yes. Um, so yeah, we just about made it on time, just. And then obviously afterwards, we grabbed some lunch quickly and um, the little ones were, uh, were desperate to get home. They were, they were. Joseph's had enough. Yeah. Um, although he was really, really good. He was really yeah. well behaved, but um, he wanted to come home. So we thought we'd just come straight back. It was a lot of fun though, wasn't it? It was good fun. It was really good. So so if you are up here or if you go online, we're not sure when the, the piece that we've just recorded with, with Jodie, we don't know when that's going out. Um, maybe I'll find out. Maybe I'll send an email and find out. But um, but keep a listen out on MFR for it. And um, keep helping, keep donating on the charity page, guys. We, we, couldn't, we couldn't thank you enough, you know, for, for the 600 that we've raised so far and supporting us um, for the rest of the year as well. It's just amazing. It's really, really, really good. So I'm really happy. Anyway, guys, we're going to crack on with the rest of the day. Um, so, yeah, we'll see you in a bit. Okay, guys, I literally have no idea where the day has gone again. Our day is just this up here. So Zoe is just doing a few orders for Leopard Fox Designs. I'm going to go and take them to the post office in a minute after I pick the kids up from school and give them an update on what we've done today. We didn't really tell them this morning what we were doing because we didn't want them to get upset because we only have one car and we'd have to take them out of school and that kind of stuff. So I'll give them a lowdown on what we've done today. They'll be really excited because we've got some freebies to give them as well from MFR. They gave us these blow up things and stuff to give to them. So I've just sorted the car out. Uh, Zoe, you're going to give me this stuff to post in a minute, aren't you? Yeah. Um, so I've got some things to post for Zoe. I've already said that, haven't I? I've already said that. I feel like I've been running today. I've been running all day. Uh, yeah, so literally, in a minute, I'm going to go out to school, pick them up, have a nice little update with them, and um, bring them out. Okay, so I've picked everybody up from school. How's everybody doing? Good. You right, Toby? Yeah. You right, Agnes? Yeah. You right, Twinnies? Yeah. You all good, yeah? Yeah. So, Lee and Erin have got book bags from school, haven't you? With new with new books and things? Yeah. Are they free books? Yeah, I didn't have a book that we already got from home. I don't get they them. They look really good, actually. I don't, I don't think you get them in people. No, you only get them in one year, yeah. don't you, I think? You get, the, you get no. your free books. 
and your pens and pens and your crayons and stuff I like that. I didn't get any free books. No, you will do. You will do. I don't. So I, I just want. All right. I just wanted to tell you something. Yeah. So do you know the lady that speaks on the radio in yeah. the mornings that does Jody, uh, Jody that does um, School of the Week and all that kind of stuff? Yeah. So me and Mummy met her today. We went over to Inverness to MFR Studio to the radio station. Wait, did you I wanted to go. Yeah. And we had a chat with Jody that's on the morning show. What do you think to that? Yeah. Is that really cool? Wait, who came with you? Um, there's only a couple of us went, so just the normal. So I Flo, to go. Flo and Joseph came, didn't they? And obviously Olivia and that. So um, what they did though is they gave us a bag of stuff with like blow up microphones and things and pens and all that kind of thing. A microphone? A blow up one, you know, an inflatable one. Oh yeah. So um, we can give you one. We got loads of them, so we can give you one each from them. But it was really, really good. Yeah. Yeah. It was really good. Did you get to bring my stuff home? I couldn't tell you earlier because we only had one car because my car's in the garage, isn't it? So so I couldn't take it. Wait, are you in mummy's car? Yeah, I'm in mummy's car. So I couldn't take it, so I couldn't tell you and, and I, I did I didn't want you car. to I didn't want you to go to school feeling bad, okay? That you didn't go. So I thought I'd tell you now. So how cool is that? Yeah. So when you're listening on when you're listening on the radio in the mornings going to school, you might you might hear mummy and daddy having a chat with Jodie. That's really cool, isn't it? Yeah. She's really, really nice. Really nice lady. Actually, actually like Miss Ward. Yeah. She was a really nice lady. So uh, it, was really, it was really lovely to meet them and, and, and uh, we had a really good time. So anyway, next time if we go, they said, they said we'll, we'll have to bring everybody. So next time when the car's fixed, if we go on the radio again, we'll take everybody, yeah? Yeah. Cool. We Not well, whenever. We'll just see, see, how, see what we can do. Yeah. When your car's fixed. Yeah. Not you know, if if they want us to go back on the radio. Because we were talking about how much money we'd we'd raised and how we were fundraising, girls. Yeah? Because yeah. we've raised six hundred and twenty seven pounds now. What? Yeah, it's quite a lot, isn't it? It's really good. One thousand. No, six hundred and twenty seven we've raised. Right, do you wanna go home then? Yeah. yeah. I'll show you what we got? Yeah. Okay, cool. <coughs> strap yourselves in then, girls. I strap myself. <laughs> That is brownies you smell because Isabel's baking. <laughs> Are they cool? Yeah. They got MFR, MFR microphones. What do you think, baby Flo? Yeah. <laughs> I'm making a vegetable chilli. I don't know how it's going to turn out. Uh, actually, can you get me a chilli? Can I get a brownie? Um, we have no, you have taco mixed beans, two of. We have chopped tomatoes with chilli and peppers, two of. We have some butter beans. Ow! That's just if she's fighting. And we have Chili con carne. Chili con carne. At least the hot ones are the normal ones. Last oh, time I no. got the hot one. It was and it was crown. too hot. Turn them upside down. It wasn't too hot. Lizzie was they didn't crown. like it. Two chili con carne. Yes, she does. And two bags of car. Actually, I think they're not too much. Do you think it's going to fit in this pan? Give the big wheel out. Get your cauldron out. <clears throat> so the big fine. silver one. What? Um, I've got two bags of them because I was worried that it wouldn't be enough because obviously I didn't buy mints. So I'm going to get a bigger pan um, and then we're going to chuck it all in and see how it goes. I've got a bigger pan. Um, it's not that much bigger to be honest. Right, so I am going to start with water. I need water. Can you get me 500 mils of cold water please? Cold? I am going to just put it all in a pan. 
Because I'll, um, really bad. Really bad. Really bad. Right, apparently I turned the camera off. Hey, what do you mean? Right. What are these? Oh, that's, that's a they don't even cut. They cut your foot with scissors, that's oh why. Oh my god, really must have a thousand pairs of scissors and none of them work. Does that one work? Because the children steal them all and do crap stuff with them. Right, so these are just veg. Um, frozen casserole veg, carrot, sweet, turnip, celery, and sliced onions. Vegetables. More vegetables. Oh, you it's got a veg. Yeah, I like it's a veg. Moldy. It's, just, it's sweet. It's just got skin on it. It's just sweet. Why is quite a lot of veg? No, because I've got to mix them in. Right, you can mix those yeah. in with them. I'm going to add the beans. I've got a feeling I'll probably need to add more liquid. So I might just add the liquid from oh, the beans. What are you doing? Dumping. Oh, they look nice. Yeah. Yeah. Smell nice. Oh, they're in a spicy, spicy oh. amount. Jojo, 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 Jeez. You know, you've got to keep them in the oh, like yeah. And there you do it. Oh, you know my new jumper that I got yet? Um, my birthday. Yellow one. You know, I got a sauce, pasta sauce for it yesterday. Ooh. Okay. Yes. It's frozen, to be honest. Sorry. It's fine, it's fine. What's this? What's she doing? I'm literally just actually, do you know what we haven't made for a while? And that's that taco soup. soup taco soup. That was really, that's what I was really nice. yesterday. Yeah, that was, yeah, that was a lot of, somebody gave me that recipe during COVID. And, and I, um, that's the first meal I tried and I like it. It was, it's basically just a lot of tins. Um, so it's something really good to use if you've got like lots of cupboard stuff in. This is kind of a bit like that, to be honest. This, this yeah, meal is such a... No, and it's got no mint in it. Yeah, there's, there's a little bit of a stigma around tin veg and stuff. And it shouldn't be, because it's just fine as the washing machine in the background. It's the same thing, it just lasts longer. So you can be making the like, version of the chilies well, in a warm. Water. 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 You're not sure about butter beans, no. are you? But I, I love butter beans. I like them. I love beans, I'm not sure. Right, so I'm going to mix it all in. <laughs> Oh no, it's all frozen, it's with the frozen mess. I might actually have to just start heating it through. Because yeah, it's frozen. Yeah, I'm just going to be hot. I'm probably going to have to add more liquid. Hello. that to warm just to ruin it and I'll be back. Right, so this is what it looks like. It's still quite frozen. Um, obviously we're using frozen veg so it's a bit frozen but I don't actually think we need any more liquid. No. So we just used a liquid that was in the tin and the two packs of chilli mix. Yeah. Um, so basically all I'm going to do is heat it through. That's pretty much it. 
I've put some rice on, which you can't see. Oh. Now my tripod's gone all weird. Um, so I basically do a cup of rice, two adults normally. One cup? Yeah. You do about four adults. Can you? I normally mm. do two cup for two. I, I, I do about four. That's just, why just I always four. do too much rice then. Yeah. Ben does a cup for four. Oh, well, a bit, a bit, I do a big cup for four. Well, that's a cup. You don't yeah, like, get like any bigger than that. Like that. Well, that's yeah. Yeah, more than that. That's about I maybe. Think he's fighting. <laughs> <That's fighting. laughs> yeah. They've all got these. Can you run your things? <laughs> They've all got these. And this is what they're doing with them. Smack. Yeah, this. On each other. Well, you want to play Will you stop whacking me for a start? Do you want to play waka waka? Stop playing waka waka. Here you go. So anyway, I've just done, I've actually just done what's left in the pack, so it's about a cup and a half for twins, the twins, Noah, Charlotte, and Natalie have some left over. Um, Maybe it's Eva can have some left And then later on, because some of us aren't eating until later, because I've got to go out in a minute. Um, but there's probably enough there to feed people for about three days. Um, it's quite a lot. And not everybody will have, Eva is not keen on yeah. kidney beans, although there's not many kidney beans. It looks nice. She could pick them out. It does look nice. Um, but anyway, maybe she'll try a little bit. Ah! But anyway, I'm literally just going to heat it through and um, do the rice and this the base food for all the others that aren't going to eat this. That's what they get. Right, so dinner has been done. So it turned out, it needs a little bit more cooking, I think, but um, it turned out fine. Uh, tastes quite nice, actually. I had to go out and <clears throat> pick Elise up from college. So I left Isabel and Ben cooking. Well, it wasn't, it just needed warm through. Um, but yeah, it was quite nice. We're gonna eat it later. I uh, might just cook it through at least a little bit more just to soften the veg a bit more. But it was actually quite yummy. I think it turned out all right. So it's just kind of a load of veg chucked in with beans and chilli mix. It's really, really simple. Um, and it's got lots of different beans in it, which are really um, which are really good for you. Especially when you haven't put meat in. Um, things like beans and pulses and lentils and stuff are always good when you're not adding meat and they are a very good, cheaper alternative as well. Um, we don't eat a lot of meat, really. Um, so not a huge amount of meat. Uh, and not all the kids like meat that much. Um, so it's always good, things like lentils, beans, pulses, all those sorts of things are always good to put in as an alternative. Um, so yeah, it's been, it's kind of been a bit of a weird day today. It's, uh, obviously we've had the, the MFR radio, um, interview, which was really good fun. Um, that kind of, you know, we, we were in a bit of a rush to get there this morning. We didn't have much time to think about things before you get there. And then, um, you know, these things are always, you always get a little bit nervous before doing them. Cause obviously, you know, we, we vlog every day. But we're doing it, we're filming it. So when you're doing it um, with somebody else, it's always a little bit, same as filming for the TV and stuff, it's always a bit nerve wracking. But um, no, they, you know, they were a great team. They put us all at ease. They were great with the kids that were there. Um, and it's just, it's just a really nice place. It just seems like a really chilled kind of place to work. So, um, or, or to be in, you know, just a really kind of nice place. They're a good, a really good bunch of people. So, um, yeah, it was really nice. It's really good fun doing it. And hopefully it will raise a lot more awareness um, to, you know, the, the Cash for Kids, really, to, to raise more money for um, for Cash for Kids, because that's what it's all about at the end of the day. Um, the Mission Christmas, I know we're kind of in January, we've just done Christmas, but our kind of goal is if we can keep it going all year long until the very beginning of December when that's, that's when all the funds kind of, um, they start collecting all the, the money in and everything. Um, you know, just make as much as we can 
really to help just a little bit just you know just a little bit of help um so that's why we're doing the challenges i say we it's going to be mainly ben but anyway um oh no we'll try and do things as a family as well but you know we're gonna i think ben's gonna put out soon what we're gonna be doing next month or ask obviously nothing too crazy guys please um so yeah i think the kids are just getting ready to bed i don't think the kids are just getting ready for bed i'm just in the middle of sorting out some washing and uh yeah we'll be back in a minute Well, that's been a bit of a day, hasn't it? It's been a weird day. It has been really odd. Obviously, because when I normally film a video, I've got it all mapped out in my head. And I know exactly what we're going to film and what we're going to do. And then when Zoe does hers, Zoe does hers. Zoe doesn't have, <laughs> Zoe doesn't, doesn't have anything mapped out in her head. Zoe just, just goes for it, which is why which is why both stars <coughs> video work. But anyway, it's been one of those days that... Um, it's just been really weird, hasn't it? It's gone. It's weird. gone really quickly. Being at MFR today was absolutely brilliant. Meeting Jodie was great. That was fantastic. Um, meeting the whole team in Inverness was brilliant. Uh, the younger ones, the little ones, loved all the little gifts and everything they gave us. They gave us like little books the and the moon. pens and the roof of the moon. All that kind the of stuff. Twins and Agnes have all got a, a post-it note. Little book full of post-it notes. And, it's Larry. Yeah, it's really, really good. So we'll look forward to. Um, <laughs> so we'll look forward to uh, that little bit coming out on on the radio. We'll yeah, try and let you know. know. We'll try and let you know because I'm sure you'll be able to be able I'm to get it sure to play. Pretty sure you can listen to um, digi on digital yeah. radio because I know yeah. we can listen to um, Pirate FM, which is a Cornish radio station. When we can listen to it from here, obviously yeah. on digital, so on Alexa. There we go. So I still had no news yet about my job. I'm still waiting to hear back from uh, my last job interview. I am looking for other stuff as well, other jobs. So just keep, I'll keep you updated on that. Uh, tomorrow, what's happening tomorrow? Normal day? Don't Wednesday? Is it Wednesday tomorrow? I Normal day? I my brows done in the morning. Oh, I might get mine done. Get mine done. You've got to pick your car up. I've got to pick my car up, yeah. It's staying overnight because we ran out of time to go and pick it up today. And that's fine, I'm happy with that. So we're gonna pick it up tomorrow morning. Um after the school run. Oh. It's about just, it, go on. I was just parceling up some brownies, postal brownies. Isabel, just show us a minute. She's um Oh you oh no she can't. She, you you're filming a little video, are you? Yeah. She's okay. filming a video. This is this is our brownies, but it's just for filming. Okay. She's parceling them up. They're very nice. I'm gonna I'm gonna put Isabel's uh Bell's Bakes Instagram on our Look. LinkedIn at some point. LinkedIn? Oh, it's Link tree. Stop. Link tree. Yeah. Look at yeah. those. Look at those. They look good. Oh man, they smell amazing. So there's a mixture of Kinder. Kinder. Nutella. Aero. This is um, a brookie, this miss. A brookie. Brookie bite. These ones are for us, so you can Crunchy. Them. This Terry's is a, this chocolate is a orange. Original brownie. Milky Way. Dark chocolate, Kinder, Biscoff, mint, dairy milk, Oreo. Oh, they smell amazing. It looks amazing. They smell amazing. It's just passing me off at the moment, brown. Fine. The problem is it doesn't stick. Oh, it's because it's greased with paper. Yeah. It looks amazing. Maybe I'll do something else. Mm. Brilliant. Right, that's it for today, guys. Uh, we're wrapping it up. And we're on to tomorrow, so um, yeah, we'll look forward to filming tomorrow. But for now, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, please subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell for notifications. Drop us a like. Don't forget our link tree in the video description below for all of our social media, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, charity homepage, Leopard Fox Designs, and soon to be Bells Bakes as well. And that just leaves us to say thank you for all of your support, guys. Take care, and we'll see you in tomorrow's video.